I'm um, Kevin Sinclair. I'm a professor of developmental biology here at the University of Nottingham. I'm part of a larger group here at Nottingham that have an interest in reproductive biology. And the cloned animals that we have here on the campus today are actually a legacy of a former colleague of mine, Keith Campbell. And Keith, uh, along with Ian Wilmot and others at Roslyn, back in the uh, 1990s, was responsible for a programme of research that led to the birth of Dolly, the first cloned animal. And when Keith came to Nottingham, round about uh, 2000, he continued with that programme of work. He developed a team here at Southern Bonington to investigate the mechanisms linked to efficient reprogramming during uh, the nuclear transfer process. And these animals are a consequence of that. They're, they're a part of that program of research that Keith had at the time. Keith sadly passed away in 2012 and the university approached me because I had parallel interests in assisted reproductive technologies and they asked if I would take responsibility for these animals. They also inquired if they had any scientific value, which of course they clearly had. And the area that I thought was most pertinent, most relevant to investigate was healthy ageing in such animals because it's never been properly investigated. There's been no detailed studies in terms of, of their health. And this is really important. It informs us in the safety of these kind of uh, biotechnologies for future application.